Hey there guys and welcome to my most dreaded season at university. The final season! <laughs> at this point of the semester. I am always dead. I'm just a bit burnt out. I'm done. Yeah, I love learning. Yeah, I love my university, my degree, all of these things. But right now, I don't. <laughs> Not as much. I'm actually quite ready for Christmas and break. In the next week and a half, I somehow have to produce my entire like thesis end of semester huge progress so that I can just finish it next semester. For this deadline it's gonna probably be 12,000 words. And then I have another three essays to do, a huge presentation and a video to make. So it's a lot. And then YouTube and all of that stuff and then I'm moving out and then I'm moving to Taiwan next semester and it's just a lot. Welcome to the get motivated with me, study with me, try not to just die finals vlog. Here we are. This video is also so exciting because it's sponsored by literally the camera that I use every single day and that I adore. If you're interested in being a vlogger, guys, look no further. This is the best vlogging camera I have ever used. And I say that with total honesty, not because I'm paid to say that. You know I'm always honest with you guys and this camera is just life-changing. This beautiful thing you're seeing right now is the Sony ZV-E10. I'm gonna drop some little notes throughout because this whole video is filmed on this glorious camera. It makes vlogging easier. It makes my life less stressful when I wanna vlog during literally the busiest time of uni. Great video, great audio, great autofocus, great everything. I hope you enjoy and I hope I still look this perky in the next week and a half. Okay, before we become a study guru, for the next 30 seconds, I'm going to pretend to be a tech reviewer just to show you all the cute things this cam has. So firstly, you can give it a mohawk with the mic wind protector, which we'd love to see. And then all the buttons on the camera have been designed and optimized for vlogging. Like the record button is central. There's an easy button to give your background the bokeh effect, which makes it look professional and blurred. And something revolutionary, which, you know, might be stretching my tech abilities a bit. Interchangeable. You can, there's like T and W, tight and wide, and you can go tight, and you can see, look, it's zooming. Oh, wow. Whoa! Right? <laughs> and it like keeps the focus the whole time. It's literally crazy. It's so good. Wow. It's so good. A beautiful good morning. Guys, it is such gorgeous weather today. Like the whole room is just glowing. I love this about the morning. So when there's like bright sun, you just feel like the day. I just did a meditation, showered, got ready, but I'm not making breakfast because today we're going for a roomy breakfast. Me and my roommates try and have a meal together like every two to three weeks just to catch up on life, to talk about how things are in the house. And I think just in general, it keeps a lovely relationship between all of us, like scheduling this time in our busy lives at uni. So I'm gonna go have breakfast. Let's go. This. So cute! <laughs> Hi friends, so I've travelled all the way to Palermo today because the cafes here are just so good. I am stressed. I have so much to do, I cannot even describe to you. I'm probably gonna sit here for the next like five hours and just keep like ordering things to sustain myself. I'm glad it's a nice day because it's like energizing me. But yeah, a lot. The to-do list do be overflowing. I'm trying not to be stressed. I'm trying to see the beauty in the fact that like, you know, I've got this gorgeous light here, I've got a lovely setting, I've got my lemonade, I've got Ariana Grande blasting behind me. I will never get over how wide I can make this lens. My camera's just right in front of me on the table. This is so good. And the fact that the camera is just connected to the tripod by Bluetooth and I can just use the tripod in order to zoom in out. Mind blown.
I cannot even describe how dead I feel today. Like I literally just feel dead inside. It's that time of the month. It's that time of the semester. It's that time where like our local laundromat, we don't have a laundry machine. So I use a laundromat near us and they were just full today. So they're taking my clothes for two days. So I have like two outfits left. It's just, it's just that time. I sat in the library almost all day today. Just my brain feels like a jumbled mess of ideas and concepts and things to remember, things to analyse, things to evaluate, things to link together, things to write, things to read, just so many things. I know it's that point in the semester because normally I'm very very good with my routines and my habits but they're just slipping now guys, they're slipping. I haven't been doing yoga every morning, I haven't been meditating every morning because I often have meetings early in the morning and then all day and there's just so much to do. Oh, I'm so tired. This is just gonna be a ranting clip of me like, ugh. It's also so much harder to film myself when I'm in the stakes. I'm like, do 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 to do list, to do list, things to do. So it's just, it's hard to like add on capturing it in a way that's like pretty. <laughs> Sometimes even just setting up a camera angle, you know, you gotta put a bit of thought into it. This camera makes it so much easier, this tripod makes it so much easier, but you know, it still takes some planning. So yeah, I'm now gonna do a little bit of last minute work from bed, and I'm intending to wake up early tomorrow to get some stuff done, do some deep work. I just feel like a little potato. Good morning, my dear friends. Um, it is 7.30 and I am ready, because I have to be, for <laughs> a whole day of work. I'm trying to up my commitments to good habits, which make me feel good. So, I'm gonna do yoga before my study day. It honestly feels so good to just roll out a mat again. Like, even just sitting here feels good. Anyway, okay, I'm gonna start the meditation and then I'm gonna do yoga video. Hard working queen. Uh, so tired. <laughs> Me and Fong are in the same position where we have like none of our clothes because they're all at the laundry. And I think it's just that, that point of the semester. Hey guys, so I've just been working the last two hours or so on my thesis. I feel very dead, but very in the zone. Like I have no social energy to give whatsoever, <laughs> but I'm very like in my head. So I think I'm doing high quality deep work right now. A little bit insane, but my thesis is currently 91 pages. 91 pages. It's like, I've been just going through this thing and editing it and trying to improve it. It is so much effort. Like, I feel sorry for whoever has to read this. But yeah, it's coming along, and right now I'm planning out next semester and high level goals for each month in order to achieve everything that I I use Notion, I love Notion. I have a whole capstone page, which is just my go to for every single year of the thesis. So, everything I did to keep me on track for this semester, I'm doing for next semester. And then it's just peace of mind. I can enjoy Christmas, and I know that when I come back to uni, because it has to. Such a sunny day. All of this tree, I think they're called Tipa, Tipa tree. Um, they're flowering in orange blossoms right now and it's my casual magic because in the breeze you'll just see all these orange flecks. It's so gorgeous. Favorite kind of study break will always be in nature. Let me show you what I'm seeing. Look at this place. Can you see the water? It's so gorgeous. There's all these people just relaxing. A reminder that breaks are so productive.
Hello friends, good morning. It is another day of finals, I'm up early. Today, I'm really gonna try and get my thesis done. Like my final deliverable for this semester of my thesis done. That is the only task for the day. That is what I'm gonna spend all my time doing. I have a long to-do list of different parts of it which need to be done. Because I'm literally in awe of this camera. I used it all day yesterday to vlog and it's still 70%. I can't even describe how much less stress it gives you when your vlogging camera has a good battery life. Especially during final season part, the reason I wouldn't vlog is just because it's an added stress to think about charging a camera and like, oh, is, do I have enough battery life left for the day? But this camera's just, it's just so good. This is the vibe for today. This is also the vibe for today. These are my inspirations. <laughs> not how I was expecting to watch the biggest match for Argentina with Australia. This is the one that determines whether or not they get into the final eight. But here we are in a Boba tea stop. <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm currently in a co-working space. It is 6 p.m. It is the last day where all my finals need to be submitted and I'm about to submit my final one. This is literally the moment I've been waiting for all of the last two weeks. I feel dead, but also relieved and proud. And I genuinely really like my essays and think that I've done decent work. So yeah, let's submit it. Let's do it. Yay! Oh my god, I'm so happy. The confetti. Yes! I can't believe how anticlimactic just getting confetti is after all this work. But hey ho, there we, there we go. We've done it. Guys, I just want to say the biggest thank you for supporting me in my academic endeavors this semester like i am so blessed to have so many incredible lovely comments from you guys like the number of like dm essays i've received during final season with people just spurring me on um it really means the world and it feels like you've been on this journey with me so yeah i can't believe it i can't believe the semester is basically over i can't believe that I'm going to be moving on from BA. Anyway, I hope you have a lovely Christmas. Um, I'm sending you so much love. If you've still got academic stuff to do, you've got this. You've really got this. I believe in you. And thank you for being here. Good morning! So we dragged ourselves awake. And look at our cute outfits. Ah! <laughs> so we went to sleep literally five hours ago. And we're a little bit tired but we're now at the bus stop um and it's an hour bus to the friendsgiving location i'm so excited i think they've hired out like a big house with a swimming pool and like grounds and there's 300 of us and there's like food and stuff so i'm very excited <laughs> So the theme is rainbow. Hello. Hola. Good morning. Hello. <laughs> Good morning. We made it. Are these gorgeous people? Hey. Hi. Look at the gem. 